As a kid, I grew up listening to my dad tell stories about fishing in Alaska. Stories about waves as tall as our house. Stories about funny pranks among crewmates. Stories about injuries, close calls, and even run-ins with bears. Never in my wildest dreams did I expect to join him someday. But life has a funny way of taking turns you don't necessarily expect. Gillnet fishing will open again in the Nushigak and Igushik sections from 1 a.m. until 11 a.m. July 14th, and again from 2 p.m. until 11 p.m. July 14th. This has been the Alaska Department of Fish and Game at Dillingham. Home to the most abundant sockeye salmon fishery on earth, Bristol Bay sustainably harvests more than half of the world's salmon supply. Each year, thousands of fishermen flock to Bristol Bay to fish the summer salmon run, which provides over 14,000 jobs and is essentially the lifeblood to the region. There aren't many places in the world you can go to escape, to truly escape, but Bristol Bay is one of them. Living on the water day in and day out, focusing on one thing, catching as much fish as possible, there's nothing like it. It's a feeling and experience that can't be explained, but I'd like to try anyways. You live each day at the mercy of the ocean, the tides, the weather, and the salmon. You're not living by the clock anymore. You're on salmon time. You get to watch the sunrise and sunset every single day. You have an abundance of time to think and reflect out there. You're cut off from daily distractions of the modern world, finding beauty in the basics, like reading a really good book, or finding a piece of chocolate in your backpack, or taking a hot shower at the end of it all. It makes you grateful. It makes you aware. So you see, this is how it works. The Alaska Department of Fish and Game announces daily fishing periods for the fleet in each fishing district. This means we can only legally fish during the periods they set. When the period is over, we go deliver our catch to the fishing tenders. 
We open our fish holes, hook up the brailers to a crane, and our catch is lifted off the boat, weighed, and we're given a ticket with the number of pounds of salmon we caught. After we deliver, we might have a few hours to cook up a warm meal and take a nap before doing it all over again. Fishing in Bristol Bay is truly a one-of-a-kind experience. I wouldn't trade these memories and time spent with my dad for anything in the world. I'll always carry with me the lessons commercial fishing has taught me. It's pushed me to my limits and made me question the world in new ways. It's taken me out of my comfort zone and allowed me to be a part of something much bigger than myself. I will never forget the people I've met, the adventures I've had, and the memories I've made.